Well, the countdown to the puck drop continues. Quinnipiac is in the Frozen Four, and the Bobcats are playing tonight in Tampa. Absolutely. Big night. Channel 3's Dylan Farron, who is also a Quinnipiac grad, it joins us live in Tampa, where he wouldn't want to be anywhere else, hanging out with all the Bobcats, the fans, the students. Hi, Dylan. <laughs> Guys, can't even hear you. It's so loud in here. What's up, guys? What's up? Come on. Come on. Look, I went to Quinnipiac. I know the fans travel well. I didn't know they travel this well. We are in Tampa. They are ready to go. We've been in the Frozen Four two other times. Oh, is that me? I love it. I love it. Thank you. <laughs> Look, this is the third Frozen Four appearance for the Bobcats. And this is the first time they're going to take the national championship home. If you ask these guys, if you ask these guys. Look, we are in Cigar City Brewing. Amelie Arena is just a few feet away. We're all hanging out here until the game at 830. We're getting the chance going. People have traveled from all over the country to be here, including from Connecticut. And these guys, they're just awesome. They're just awesome. Now, look, we spoke to some fans earlier today at the Frozen Fest. That's just a few feet from where we are right now. We even spoke to one person, a woman, who graduated from Quinnipiac two years ago and is now a graduate student at Michigan. It's surreal being here. I really didn't think both teams would make it at the same time, but once they did, I knew I had to be here. Uh, truly, I'm rooting for Quinnipiac. I think they're very deserving of the title, so let's go Q. We dropped quite a bit of money, probably a little too much. My parents probably don't want to hear about it, but, you know, we, we took a flight late last night, got in at, like, 4 a.m. here in Tampa, took a connecting flight in Chicago, so a lot of jumping back and forth between time zones, but eventually we did make it down. All right, Bob, one more, one more. Come on, come on. There we go, there we go. Fantastic, fantastic. So, look, I don't even know what time it is. Minnesota and Boston University, the puck just dropped about, what, 15, 20 minutes ago. If Quinnipiac can win tonight against Michigan, they will play the winner of Minnesota and BU right now at 0-0 with 12 minutes to go in the first period. Puck drop for 8.30. All these fans can be going nuts here until the game starts. Guys, we will send it back to you. Let's go, Bobcats.